Hello. Yes, are you busy? No, I'm busy. I will see you in the call. So, are you ready? Yes, sir. Have you prepared yes, your list? Yes, sir. Okay. And please switch off your fan. I am getting a lot of air noise from your side. Okay, now okay, sir? Yes, now okay. So, have you read the story? How many times did you read the story? Have you written Three down? Three times, sir. Three times. Have you written down yes, some sir. difficult words? So that we can discuss yes, vocabulary, right? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Okay, very good. So, start the story. Tell me the summary of the story. Okay, sir. Whatever Actually, you have Actually, the story... Yes, sir. The story title is Two Stories About Flying, sir. Flying. Okay. So, there there were two stories. I had asked you to read the first yeah, story. Yeah. Actually, yes, sir. Actually, three stories. Hmm. I read only... I read only one story only, sir. Yes. What was the name of the story? What's the name of the story? The first flight, sir. Yeah. First flight. The first flight. Very good. Very the good. first flight. Okay. So, actually... Actually, one seagull, sir. Young seagull, child seagull. Seagull means birds, yes. sir. Okay, no? Yes, yes, sir. Yes. Yeah, seagull. Actually, he's a very young seagull. Oh. He's, he has a father, mother, and uh, his two brothers, his uh, one girl, sir. Mm-hmm. Actually, he's a very young seagull, young bird. Mm-hmm. How to fly in the sky? Mm-hmm. He's so afraid. Oh. And, uh, yeah, so afraid. One mm-hmm. day, he's uh, alone in the whole age, sir. Mm-hmm. First of all, the trial for the how to fly in the sky, mm-hmm. he forward than the edge and the uh, wings, sir, wings, it is mm-hmm. wings. Mm-hmm. He's so afraid and uh, he now oh, he does not uh, improve, he does not uh, now my fling wings and mm-hmm. he returned to the hole and uh, another day sleep sleeps in the old age. Mm-hmm. Then again, the father and the mother calling the his, his name is she, Seagull, Seagull, mm-hmm. right, sir? Seagull. The child, uh, Seagull. Seagull. Yeah, bird name is Seagull. Mm-hmm. They're calling Seagull, Seagull. Mm-hmm. He was so disappointed. Mm-hmm. Disappointed. He was so disappointed. Mm-hmm. I, I could not fly in the sky. Mm-hmm. And, uh, he was calling. And that day he was uh, 24 hours. He was, uh, don't, does not want any people meet him. Mm-hmm. And uh, he was uh, so scared. I did not, could not uh, eat any, any food. Could not eat. That eat, eat, yes. Could not eat any food. Did not eat because uh, his mother and father did not provide him any food. Yes, not provide. Then uh, another morning, sir. Then his brother and the sister, two brothers and sisters, sleep. His brother. His two brothers. His yes, two brothers and his sister mm. as they yeah, sleep, uh, sleep in the some of the place age. And he saw the father. Father was... Uh, some of the removed white, black, and his mother was, his mother was, his mother was not searching she. for the food. His mother. His mother. His mother. Uh, his mother. Okay. His mother was searching for the food, hmm. and his mother going to, and again the, the she will was move the edge hmm. and how to fly in the sky. Hmm. Again he tried, but hmm. he had to close one eye and step one step, hmm. leg up and the leg. Mm. And his mother was saw him. Mm. Oh, what is she do? Mm. Then again, he's flying the wrapping in the flag, but could not could not fly in the door. Then mother was come took in the some of the fish, mm-hmm. took in the some of it and took in the fish. But any one person don't like the fish. This type of fish, this is madness food. Everyone people told this is madness food. And again, everyone people go to the flying and the searching for the food. Mm-hmm. Then she will was alone in the mm-hmm. whole age. Mm-hmm. Okay. Then again, his mother was uh, mm-hmm. two cold fish and uh, his mother. Why do you the, say she mother? His fish. mother. His mother. Okay. okay. His mother took uh, some of the fish mm-hmm. and uh, returned to the forward to the him mm-hmm. that sailed. Mm-hmm. He was yeah, mouthing was mouthing feed. The mouthing. Mm-hmm. So unfortunately, this, the mm-hmm. young she will was. Uh, Mm. Down far in the sea, sir. Mm. You won't happen. Who oh, the mm. child was could not fly in the sky. How to manage it? Mm. Then suddenly everyone, this is not not 
ka 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 mm. but she is very angry could mm. not eat yesterday any food so mm. she, she is so he is so tired could not eat ka 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 and then suddenly he go to the flying in the forward in the sky edge mm. and he took the some of the food he had a and yeah yeah fish the story is line is here mm-hmm. example me is me also my childhood childhood days example my age is 1 1 to 2 age i could not know how to walk in the road how to mm-hmm. walk in the home i mm-hmm. could not know example also is a child yeah child bird mm-hmm. he could not know how to fly in the sky mm-hmm. step by step he may be flying in the sky this uh, content very good you also that was your story you did not know how to walk right yeah it is sorry sorry content sir yeah. content who you taught you on people child people who taught you yes. to walk who taught you to walk sir who taught who taught you how to walk who taught you who walking taught? who yes, who taught, taught. You walking? teach teach who oh, teach taught. you teach teach okay okay teach means my father and mother sir. yeah how to then this bird also the seagull he he was just hatched he just he had come out from his his egg shell just a day before yes yes right sir understand maybe a day before or two or or some days back and he did not know how to fly but his brothers and his sister Uh, yeah had already learned uh, how to fly so who taught this seagull this young seagull how to fly who taught who taught him is who taught oh is the mother right Ma- yes mother how did uh, the mother uh, teach him how to fly okay what was the mother the mother some of the mother took him the mouse fish and yeah. follow to him and and take, take take suddenly he has a down stairs down of the yeah street. to take the fish the mother came too close and one day he was left to starve right left to eat yes, yes. he yes, he yes. was not provided any food by his parents right his mother and father yes, yes, yes. so for one day he was you know left to starve and he had gone mad out of anger out of hunger right so yes right <clears throat> so this, this is how and they they you know mocked him scolded him but still he was too afraid to fly so this is how the mother used the technique she took a fish right or yes, a, took right? A, 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 a piece of fish and and flew too close and flew too close to close to this uh, this child this child seagull my bird okay and when he yes yes he was already you know uh, mad with hunger so he also tried to pick uh, or take the piece of of fish which uh, his mother was carrying but she again flew away right and this this yes, yes, yes. this seagull when he attempted to catch the uh, uh, take the piece of the fish he fell down from the ledge right ledge he, yes, fe- he, he fell down from the rock and then he uh, first he was afraid but later he started to fly right he learned he got the strength in his wings right and he learned how to fly and also how to skim over the surface of sea right and how to yes. even hunt uh mm-hmm. for his food right very good yes yes understand. okay have you written down any any words which you don't understand the meaning of yes sir yes sir mm-hmm. any words have you written down i had asked you to write some yes 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 yes, yes, yes. this is uh, this is how you improve your vocabulary whenever i send yes yes i understand yes. sir yes so any words any difficult words or just open the story and then and then again scan it and if you have any difficult word you can discuss it with me one second one second i will open the story okay fine sir okay sir okay sir okay actually one doubt sir one one sentence yes 
Eight means I know. Eight I know. Mm. I some of the reading read the stories. Some of the words come. Yeah, we are read. Y y h i e d. Y what is the meaning, sir? Head. Y head. Explain me. One second, sir. I put in your WhatsApp now. Yes, yes, your WhatsApp. Put. Okay, sir. Mm. No. Okay, head. I know. Head I know, sir. Head yes. I know. Yes. Actually, some of the people. Let's read the story. What what was the sentence? Read the sentence. One second, one second. Headlong. Head. Means? Head. What is it? Oh, head. Sir. A head means. Head. Head. A, a head. That is a head means forward. A head. Forward. Yes. Yeah, yeah. A head means in front of. Suppose um, there is a line of people. There is a line of people, line. right? And first, you are the first. Yeah. I am the second. You are the. first in the line and oh. the second in the line so i will tell i will tell people that amin is ahead of me amin is ahead of me means yeah. Yeah. ahead means amin is forward of me amin amin is in in front of me right yes amin means forward of me okay okay yeah definitely yes and i am behind amin okay suppose i am standing behind right behind amin. yeah you okay. are Back standing it. before amin is before me ahead means before or forward move ahead okay okay means right. move forward ahead means headlong move ahead move forward right you understood in a line okay, okay, there right. is a line of people and you are the first in the line and the second in the line so i will tell others that amin is ahead of me amin is before me amin is in front of me right amin is the foremost so move ahead means move forward right this is right sir kumar he had forward the message <laughs> ahead itself means forward don't write ahead and forward so oh, kumar had the message kumar forwarded the message but kumar went ahead kumar kumar went ahead means go ahead means forward ahead means move forward see move ahead move ahead means move ahead means move forward move forward you understand forward means first okay so ahead means forward or in front of in front of you understand before you understand yes sir kumar went ahead yes. went ahead ahead means forward ahead means before i am um, ahead means before, before. before. Ahead. okay okay then okay right well, okay when suppose you are going to uh, you know the gateway of india right okay, hello then. you went to gateway yeah. you, you stand behind gateway of india what you see ahead ahead of gateway of india what do you see ahead of the gateway of india i i went uh, yeah head gate of india right you know what <laughs> just listen to me first listen to me don't don't hurry up what do you see ahead of the gateway of india what do you see ahead you see the sea you see the sea what is ahead what is ahead of the gateway of india what is went sir high went sir ahead means before learn it beneath means under ahead means before right before what comes what comes ahead of one forward yes forward suppose i am giving you c this letter a b c what is ahead of b what is ahead of b which letter is ahead of b b before ahead means in front of okay ahead in a line okay okay the line okay uh, suppose in your body in your body what comes first what comes first in your body which part okay. comes first yes, this is right i mean yeah gate in the gate of india ahead of the gateway of india ahead of the gateway i mean gateway of india okay. ahead of the gateway of india i went okay, okay. ahead of the gateway of india ahead is an okay. adverb it is uh, right Okay, okay. Yes, I understand. I went ahead. 
okay it could be preposition also okay ahead of the gateway of india ahead means forward right okay, okay, forward you understand forward go forward means go ahead okay forward forward okay Supp i went forward suppose you ask me for some permission right suppose you ask me sir i want to read the news paper today then i will say go ahead go ahead very good go ahead right ahead means go forward go forward okay go forward what you can understand sir understand suppose yes, you yes. or suppose you you went to your father asking father i want a new bike i want a new bike then yes, your father yes. will say go ahead very good go ahead there is no problem go ahead buy buy go ahead buy a new bike okay yeah go ahead go ahead well done go ahead move ahead good understood okay okay understand understood sir ahead means forward you can say forward because in your body your head comes first what comes first head come first so go ahead and 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 the opposite is go back opposite is go back because back, go back. opposite meaning of ahead is back go back and just keep listening don't repeat after me ahead means past ahead means past <laughs> ahead means forward ahead means forward understood yes sir understood sir yes any other word ahead means forward okay. ahead means forward suppose you ask ask me uh, for some permission to permission to go to dubai suppose or permission to go to uh, the usa then i when right then i will okay, say yeah. well done go ahead go ahead nobody will stop you go oh, ahead okay. move go ahead, ahead. Go keep ahead. moving nobody will stop you right keep moving but keep when moving. i okay you okay, can understand sir and Un understand when when yes, a, yes, understand sir right move ahead means keep moving forward head long ahead okay sir okay understand then is a lead sir lead l e a i d lead lead spelling l a l e l e i d sir lead l okay lead lead is the v2 yes v2 of lay right lay v2 v1 sir lead lane lay lead lane that is the uh, v2 form of lay lay you understand lie you understand lie down lie down in your bed lie no sir lie lie you don't know lie down i was lying on my bed i was lying lie on my bed means i was sleeping i was lying on means uh, uh, right i was not sitting lying you don't understand lying means uh, lying flat on your bed be, you know uh, all your body is lying okay okay lying means lie, before lie. sleep how do you sleep on your bed before sleeping lie lie lay, lay. you lay, lie down lay, okay you lie down on your bed right lay means making somebody lay means making somebody lie making somebody lie okay sir somebody lie, lie. for example lie. my mother my mother was laying my dastar khan you understand my mother Sorry, was dastar khan dastar khan a cloth on which you eat a cloth a piece of cloth on which you eat right you put your plates on on the suppose table cloth my mother was laying the table cloth my mother was laying the table cloth when i entered the room. let me explain laying means how okay put lay means put down lay means put down see see i have sent you come to the whatsapp my okay, mother okay. was laying the table cloth when i entered laying means she okay, yeah. was putting lay lay means lay means fake sir is uh, fake fake, fake also lie lie means fake also lie down means before sleeping you just you know uh, go flat lie oh listen to okay. me lie has two okay. meaning lie means fake also lie means you go to bed and just sleep before sleeping you put your hands and your legs and your back flat on the bed 
that is called lying i was lying on the whole day i was lying on my bed because i was ill there are two meaning any okay, word okay, has okay. and laying means i was i was laying my kid i was laying my kid or i laid my kid means i made my kid to lie down i i laid my kid i laid my kid means or mother is saying mother laid the kid to sleep understand okay let me let me give you an analogy you eat you know the <laughs> meaning of eating eating and feeding okay. this is right now the feeding eating eating feeding you know similarly lying lying on the bed means if you are lying and laying mm-hmm. means laying means you are making a baby to lay to lie you are making a baby to lie down suppose okay, a okay, baby is okay. crying a baby is crying you put the baby on the bed and you you know tap you you tap on his head so that he sleeps that is called laying down right laying the baby and v2 form is laid means he laid the she laid the baby to sleep means she laid the baby to sleep means she she put the baby on bed that means meaning the baby okay she put she put the baby on bed okay laid means laying means past v2 form okay yeah. on bed to sleep she put okay make somebody sleep is called laying and laid is v2 form simple past see understand this sentence come to the whatsapp okay, okay understand she laid the baby okay, okay, understand understand laying okay laid and laying egg also birds lay birds what do they birds the lay baby. eggs birds lay the eggs baby. see the listen baby. listen don't don't repeat birds lay birds eggs lay egg. what do birds what birds give lay means put down lay means put down down the birds deliver that is when the birds deliver eggs it is called laying birds lay eggs birds lay eggs so that is that is simple simple present birds lay eggs is simple present and the bird the bird laid two eggs today two eggs today today means the the bird delivered two eggs today the the bird put down two eggs today the bird laid two eggs today laid you understand here laid me delivered right the bird mm-hmm. delivered two eggs that is laying down believe okay okay, okay understand sir. understand you humans yes, humans deliver babies humans deliver babies but the birds lay eggs the bird lay eggs means put down lay means put down something lay the table cloth on the table means you put down spread the table cloth on the surface of the table lay you understood okay okay sir understood lay how how yes, do you, sir. how do you put the baby to sleep you lay the baby on the bed lay the you lay the baby on the bed and she, she will sleep okay any other word very good Did you understand if you have not yes, understood yes. then ask understand. me again okay very good okay understand sir okay now plug sir plug plug is p l u p l u n g plunge plunge means plunge. Plunge. plunge means come down or go down down very fast very fast fast very fast go down suppose birds birds plunge okay from from the sky plunge means go down immediately see a bird suppose a bird was flying in the sky up ever right and immediately it saw it, it it saw some fish in the sea so immediately it come down immediately it came down immediately it came down and 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 hunted plunge. the fish plunge plunge means go down plunge. come down plunge. plunge go down plunge 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 into water plunge. the 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 swimmer the swimmer plunged into into the water into the water 
okay or into water plunge means go down immediately very fast drop down plunge you understand plunge is understand plunge drop down go down come down plunge birds a bird was flying in the sky and it took a plunge means it came down immediately and picked up the fish from the surf, okay, okay. From, from the sea understood plunge, okay, understand, right? plunge means go down immediately right yeah, okay, okay, understand. he plunged his okay, head then, means he, he, he immediately put his head down right or move his head down plunge there is a plunger also plunger is used to you know uh, what your your father is in milk business right so there is a plunger plunger is used to you know mix the milk plunger have you seen the plunger plunger huh? plunger. No. plunger is used to mix the milk in a big can in it's big 40 milk. liter have you seen 40 liter can 40 liter can yeah, I, I i saw it milk milk tanker have you have you seen milk tanker a milk yeah tank? i sent huh? and, and I there, is, there is a big plunger which you know workers use the plunger to mix the mm -hmm. entire milk in the tank mm -hmm. plunger you understand plunger 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 ask your father what is a plunger plunger means a plunger is a, is, uh, um, is a type of equipment or instrument or is a type of tool right mm -hmm. just like ladder okay, plunger you use plunger to mix the mix milk in, in mix milk in a tanker or in in a big can right plunger means move down go down the plunger up. plunger means also forward la forward and uh, no no, come, no. Come. Plunger, plunger is a device to mix milk plunger is a plunge means come down immediately drop down, down fall down plunge means fall down Plunge means fall down, fall down, fall come down. down. Falling. Plunge means fall down. Falling. Fall down, you know, understand. Plunge fall. also yeah, means fall. Fall down. fall down. Yes. The bird was flying in the sky and when it saw a fish mm -hmm. swimming in the sea, the bird immediately plunged down and, and down. picked the and hunted the fish. Plunge. Okay. Understood plunge? plunge. Plunge means, yes, plunge means, plunge means, plunge means, plunge means, go, plunge means, go down. Yes, go down or come down or fall down oh, or down. drop down. Okay. Oh, okay. Any other word? Ask me the word. Okay, one second. Though so you should have written it down before the call. Ledge, ledge, ledge. 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 ledge means a kind of rack, shell, ledge, ledge means a kind of shelf, you understand, shelf, 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 shelf. rack, you understand, rack, yeah, I understand, shelf, shelf, I mean, cupboard, yes, cupboard, so similarly, you know, in, in some rich houses, uh, there is always a, 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 a ledge, a, a window ledge, window ledge, Window ledge means a protruding surface from uh, from the bottom part of the window where they put this uh, flower pot or any decorative material. Ledge means ledge means a kind of rack. So here ledge okay. ledge was a, a kind of shelf was made. A shelf was there on the surface of the rock or the cliff. Okay. Right. Ledge means a shelf or a rack kind of. Thing. Okay, let me shelf. Okay, okay. Shelf, which pro shelf which protrudes out from the surface of a wall. Right? Okay, okay. Yeah. Understood? Window window seal. Okay. Window, window seal, you understand? Just uh, just from the window seal, you know, some, some surface is protruding out that is called ledge. And ledge is used. Ledge. Uh, yes. And people people put some flower pots or decorative materials on the ledge, window ledge, right? Or window okay, okay. sill. Ledge means a kind of rack, and generally, generally that rack which is uh, which is you know made uh, on the window sill, right? Or near the window sill. Okay, okay, okay. I understand. Sir. Understand? Ledge means a kind of rack. Yes,
a kind of rack and it could kind be natural of, it can be natural also okay okay sir hmm. okay next next is bla uh, blazing sir blazing blazing spelling b l a z i n g blazing b l a z i n g uh, this is this yes right sir blazing blazing this is called blazing blazing means burning blazing fire blazing. means burning blazing means burning blazing fire blazing means burning right blaze burning. Okay. right a blaze means burn right he he put the house a blaze he put the house blaze. a blaze means he burnt the he set the he set fire right uh, on the house right he, he set the house on fire he set the house on blaze means burn or shine blazing sun means shining sun blazing sun right means shining okay, or burning sun right okay sir blazing, blazing fire sun. blazing fire means burning fire shining fire glowing fire right blazing, blazing fire blazing right blaze means okay, okay, blaze means burn shine blaze means what blaze means burn shine okay sir like the fire. sun blazing on the yes very good wall. The, yes the sun was blazing on the wall or overhead right or our blazing on or, the wall on our head right okay the, okay the sun. Sir, understood blaze next is uh, blaze next is uh, hump sir it's hum hum hump have you seen any round surface any round surface coming out of one horizontal surface any round round protruding protruding surface surface have you seen you know uh, have, have you seen a camel have you seen a camel camel yes sir Cam camel what is there on its back it is a hump it is a hump, hump. that's it hump hump that round that round surface that round protruding surface from its back that is called a hump sometimes you see a hump on on the back of just above the shoulders of of a bull or a cow hump hump you understand hump. similarly some humps are found on some rock round protruding surface coming out round surface coming out right a kind of mass a kind of round mass mass round okay okay understand round mass here yeah, round mass of soil round mass of so, soil or heap of soil. that's you call hump hump generally no, hump. what is found on the back what is found on the back of the camel hump hump camel back it there is a hump big hump on the camel back big hump okay what is the camel store in its hump what does the camel what? store in its hump you you must have water sir. water water yes exactly so actually the camel stores water in the form of fat it is made of fat and when the fat, fat melts then the fat melts and it it it, 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 it right it it gets metabolized then h2 or water is produced right so hump very good hump so it is said in in local language colloquially that the camel stores water in its hump that is hump, hump. and hump hump can be hump, hump a hump can be found on any surface on, on a piece of rock also on a piece right on on some ground also hump right understood okay, so yes, round yes, mass ra ah, very good hump oh, you understand round hump um, round mass yes, of any cliff 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 means a cliff. straight a a a straight a straight a straight rock big rock whose surface is straight you know some 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 mountains some rocks are slopy some are slopy some are vertically straight have you seen any any movie when when the hero takes a plunge or jumps from the cliff in adventurous sports 
they tie one rope they, they tie one rope uh, um, around their waist and they take a jump from a very high rock it is a straight its surface is straight vertical that is called a cliff cliffhanger you understand cliffhanger cliff means cliff means a straight rock some rocks some rocks are round you understand some rocks are round some rocks are slopy right their edge their their edge uh, is at an angle or their edges are at an angle some rock big rocks big rocks are straight vertically straight when you fall down just like a wall just like a wall of a building and people use the cliff to jump from it into the sea it is a, an adventurous sport adventurous sport okay. cliff you understand straight rock cliff. cliff means a straight rock a, a big rock a tall rock whose one surface is just straight okay. like like a wall plain wall it is not round okay. is rock means rock means rock rock means stone rock means stone so, okay okay cliff. rock means stone tough cliff. material hard hard soil stone rock okay. means big 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 stone any stone Any stone, okay. Any stone is called rock, right? Mountain is made of what? Mountain. Mountains are made of what? A mountain is made of soil, soft soil. Cliff. No, no. What is a mountain made of? A mountain is made of stone or rock. Yeah, made of stone. Stone yes, or yes. rock, hard material, hard soil. You understand? Rock. Yes, yes, yes. A rock is a big rock. piece of stone. A rock yes, is a big okay, piece okay, of big stone. Piece of what is rock what is made of rock you don't understand okay okay and rock the world rock and roll rock also means shape rock the world yes there there are many meanings of oh. this but rock here means okay. rock here means a piece of stone a big piece of stone is called rock mountains are made of rock rock material right minerals are found Uh, are dug out from rock okay any other word keep asking such words preying sir preying sir preying spelling pre p r e e n preying p r double e n e e n e n w e n i n g preening pre preying pre pre no pre preying preying spell give me the spelling write down preying preening yes this this is right preening preening okay preening grooming you understand grooming grooming okay how do grooming. you how do you comb your hair you comb your hair after taking bath taking a bath you comb do you comb, comb. your hair oh fo i'm asking you do you comb your hair with a comb with a comb hair oh, i don't know sir Oh ho! How do you fashion your hair? Hair. How do you put your hair in order after taking a bath? Do you use a comb to comb your hair? No. Yes, comb your hair. Comb is C C O M B comb. C O M comb. C O M B combing. You understand? A comb. Comb. I don't know the comb. Oh, let me comb hair. You understand hair? I hair understand. Hair means hair. You <laughs> you use a comb to put your hair in order. In order after taking a bath. After taking a bath. Okay. After taking a bath, what do you do? Suppose you have taken a bath. What do you do? You first washing my hair, sir. Washing my hair. Hair after after washing your hair. What do you do? After washing it. Yes. And uh, you go to a mirror. You go take a mirror. Yeah. Yes. Sir. I go to the mirror and uh, shave my hair. Shave ah. to my hair. How how do you shave your hair? Using a comb. Using a can. Shall I shall I send you the the picture of comb? Okay, comb, comb. Okay, okay. I know that comb means uh, sit. Comb means comb means 
Common seed. Do you know seed? Let's see. Spelling. Com. Let me send you the picture of com. Com. You do not understand. Little kids understand. Yeah, I know. Okay. Ha no, I com. I understand. Com seed. That is the Tamil meaning seed. Oh, then, then what? It's a see. You have to work a lot. Your vocabulary is so poor. Com also you do oh. not understand. Okay. This is a com. com. See, I am sending you the picture of com. Of a com. Okay, I know. This this is com, right, sir? This is a com. Yeah. Com. This is a com. Yes, this is a comb. This is, this is and because <laughs> the proper pronunciation <laughs> is combing. Comb, 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 comb. The B is B is silent. This is a comb. Yes. So oh, okay. that similarly birds they don't have a comb. They don't have a comb. So they fit, they arrange their feathers. Oh, for listen to me. Don't talk in between. Listen to okay. me. We we use a comb. We use a comb to to what? Arrange our hair, right? To arrange our hair. Similarly, but don't repeat after me. Just listen. Okay. Sim similarly, a bird doesn't have a comb. A bird doesn't have a. It uses its beak. Beak, you understand? It uses its beak. Means its mouth to comb its own feather. A bird arranges its feather. That is called preening. Preening means you can say grooming or makeup. Grooming. Preening means arranging, arranging the feather. And how does a bird arrange a feather? Have you seen your parrot arrange, arrange feathers? Arrange to arrange feathers using, using, using the beak. Have you seen your parrot playing with its feather and its beak? Beak, you understand? What yeah, is the please, color? Please. What is the color of beak. the parrot's beak? What is the color of the parrot's beak? Tell me. Okay, understand. Sir. Green. Sir. Oh, parrot is green, but its beak, its oh. mouth. Beak means its mouth. What is the color of its beak? A bird has a beak. A bird's mouth is called a beak. Oh. What is the color of the parrot's beak? Oh, right? Which color is? Okay. Beak green. Eh? Beak means red. Beak means what is the color of a parrot's beak? Beak means green oh, or red. Green. Okay. Sometimes green. Okay. What is the color of a crow's beak? Beak. Beak. You understand mouth. Mouth of a, the mouth of a bird is called yeah, beak. Red, 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 red. And let me tell it. Oh, oh. Beak means red. mouth, right? Yes, a bird's mouth, which is hard, which is hard. That is called a beak, right? So, so how do the the parrot arranges its feather? Feather, you understand the wings? Feather, you understand feather? Feather, I don't know, sir. Wings, feather. you understand wings? Yeah, wings means uh, it is yeah uh, hands. Hands. So wings are made of feathers. Wings are made of feathers. Have feather. you seen? Have you seen a badminton? Uh, uh, no, cork. A badminton cork. Have you seen? Cork. Yes, ba cork. Badminton cork. Cork is made of what? Yeah. Feathers. Cor a cork is made of feathers. Cork. Feather. Have you seen? Black. Is it cork or a feather? Yes. Sir. Feathers means fe fe right? Feather feather means wings. Wings are made of feathers. Wings are made of feathers. Feathers. Right? Wings are wings of birds. Wings of birds have what? Feathers. They are soft, soft material. Their soft material, right? Is is, is made uh, is called feathers. The soft material on the the soft material on the on on the wing mm -hmm. is called feathers. So when they arrange their feathers, that is called preening. We comb our hair; they preen their feathers. Preening means makeup, doing makeup. How how do these put the ladies put makeup? How do they go to beauty parlor to make themselves beautiful? Right. Similarly.
when a bird okay. prints when a bird prints it makes itself beautiful by arranging its feather using the beak okay. right they will use the beak to scratch their back how do you scratch your back suppose Are your you back is, is your back is itching your back is itching then how it's do you okay. scratch using your nails using your hand how do you scratch yes, eh? but a, a, so a, take comb 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 but but this bird a bird uses its beak a bird uses its beak to beak. scratch its back right have you have you seen your your parrot scratching its back using its beak Okay, okay, understand. That is arranging, arranging its feather, okay. arranging yeah. its okay. feather. That is called preening. Preening means grooming, arranging the feather, arranging. Okay. When a bird arranges its feather using its beak, that is called preening, making itself beautiful, making itself beautiful, arranging beautiful. the. Preening means making itself beautiful, or grooming. your vocabulary is too poor you have to work very hard never okay. be in a hurry you <laughs> are right so, how to improve the vocabulary is this is how yeah. this is how to improve yeah. work hard in, use use your daily read something daily read something daily. and learn some words that is how without see there is only one way to success that is hard work hard work okay, hard okay, okay. that is how there is no shortcut to success daily you have to read something and and meticulously you have to find the meaning of the words difficult words which you don't understand very good any other word now you understand preening what is preening don't look at my writing just say what is preening 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 means feather feather preening doesn't mean feather preening is okay. arranging the feather arranging the feather okay sir properly preening. arranging the wings they arrange they make their wings beautiful birds make their wings beautiful using their beaks using their beaks with beaks mm. they scratch they scrape they arrange their feathers using their beak right you can understand 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 so preening is arranging preening also have means arranging the feathers mm -hmm. properly arranging the feathers properly to look beautiful preening also means grooming when you are preening mm -hmm. yourself means how do you preen yourself you take a comb and then you comb your hair that is called preening preening means making yourself beautiful mm -hmm. by arranging your hair by arranging your hair similarly birds they look beautiful by arranging their wings their feathers preening means arranging properly mm -hmm. arranging okay okay sir. arranging properly their wings so that they look beautiful right okay okay sir. preening and how do they preen using their beak okay and this mexico guy is, uh, has sent me uh, a message just now <laughs> saying hello brother <laughs> hello bro your mexico friend hello hello yeah mexico friend yes yes <laughs> he has just sent me a message hello bro he is saying oh he sent a message oh yesterday did you talk no 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 guy? no 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 after you uh, after you went away we did not talk just okay. chit chat just, just a bit of chat uh, right i sent i sent him my uh, my videos and he liked them oh Hmm. Is that is that your video? You seen your videos, sir? Eh? Yeah, and he commented there also. <laughs> okay. Wow. Let let me write. I I will I will tell him I am teaching Amin. Does he know? Does he know your name? What is it? Does he know your name? This Max. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, he knows. Sir. He knows. He knows. Very good. So I just sent him the message that I am teaching Amin. <laughs> <laughs> okay okay tell me any other word preening you understood what is preening tell me preening yeah. preening is arranging feathers yeah. yes arranging the feathers feathers using what they don't have comb how did they how do they arrange their wings their feathers how do birds 
uh, one night at call center it has less number of pages it has less number of pages than uh, that uh, of the five point someone that is also by chetan bhagat i started right chetan i started you know my journey of english with chetan bhagat novels chetan bhagat novels one night at call center by chetan same chetan bhagat same author okay chetan bhagat okay okay same thing okay chetan bhagat he has written he has written many novels simple novels in simple english then and maybe many movies have been uh, you know produced uh, based on his novels like three idiots three idiots is based on five point someone and then kai poche is based on his another novel uh, three mistakes in my life and then oh, okay, half okay. half girlfriend his another novel is half girlfriend which i have not read another novel is two states two states and movies have been made movies have been made on his novel right chetan bhagat he is a very popular uh, among north indian because he him not indian oh. he is a north indian guy from delhi born and brought up in delhi around delhi can you can listen to his uh, interviews on youtube channels also chetan bhagat he writes in very simple english right okay okay anything else we, we, you have got four more minutes in your balance wow okay and that will finish your amount <laughs> if you want uh, do you want more classes i you know i will not force you you can you can submit the fee later on right okay, okay. but i hope okay, that okay. you enjoyed this journey with me something did you learn yes, something sir. yeah definitely sir definitely learn something okay now quickly tell uh, ask me something something else any other word uh, no sir it is okay <laughs> enough oh not okay 3 minutes there are still 3 minutes left ask me something ask me okay. something from you <laughs> don't don't get tired try try keep trying right okay okay sir. don't okay, take okay. rest <laughs> no no i searching for that book in <laughs> yeah from <laughs> searching from which book one night at call center so, yeah five point someone which five point someone is there okay very good order it Five point someone, and also, yes, uh, also I can recommend this Reader's Digest. Reader's Digest. Read. It, it is a magazine. It is a okay. magazine. It How is many stories in the in the book? How many stories in the book? In which book? Only one story. Only yeah. one story. One novel. Big one story. One story. One novel. Oh, big story. Okay. Big story. Chetan Bhagat writes a, a novel. Is a big story. Oh, okay, okay. Don't ask me about the number of pages of the pages, okay, right? Okay. Don't okay. ask me. Never ask me whether small. Don't go for small stories. We work hard. Work hard. You have got a lot of time. You can finish if you you can finish this novel within uh, you know one week. In one week, right? One week. Yeah. Is it possible for one week? For me? one week possible for you now for me one week yeah for you that's why i can finish it within 2 3 days 2 two, 2 days thank you you are the genius sir eh? no no <laughs> genius okay thank you very much pray some more because our audience will listen to it and they will come to me <laughs> my subscribe <laughs> my subscribers are not increasing i don't know why they are increasing only little bit maybe i'm not performing well okay no 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 <laughs> maybe they listen to my english and they think they are oh, very poor english so that's why they are not <laughs> but anyway for you at least i'm 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 i'm, I'm a bit helpful right am i helping okay, you okay. a bit do you think that you are you are you are getting some help from me or not you get the help from me sir okay very good okay then we have got 
you know what 25 more seconds <laughs> 25 more seconds you are the honest people sir yeah honest person honest person people means more than one person okay good See, in person. in the end also i am teaching you something people means two persons three persons four two persons, persons. people okay. when you talk about one man or one woman you say person you are person. an honest okay our time is up now so <laughs> one hour okay then i mean thank you very much okay sir. thank you I, thank I you i hope sir. you learned so, something okay, okay yes sir definitely oh, learn something so i will pay fees on uh, two days i will time sir i will oh. pay on okay very then, good uh, thank you very much monday monday sir, i will pay on fees on monday sir. monday or sunday monday or sunday okay after two three days very good no problem yeah two three days yeah. no problem okay, okay. that is why you uh, know you have spent too much of money i know i can understand anyway fine thank you very much okay. we'll, whenever okay, okay. whenever you, you pay you. me i will start the class okay okay tomorrow is class available <laughs> tomorrow is class available how will will or i not? take advance <laughs> advance okay okay <laughs> like jio mobile how how do uh, how how do you pay jio or airtel you they take advance or not <laughs> <laughs> how do you pay your airtel mobile is that number how do you say yes, how I do you recharge how much that was <laughs> i recharge <laughs> monthly with 2000 yeah. 200 300 yeah i okay so similarly if you pay if you want to take one class you pay accordingly two class you pay i'm sorry for that but uh, I, i don't like it but you know i have a stomach i feel hungry if i had not felt hungry i would have served you all for free right but okay, okay, you know, i have to wear clothes i have to you know take food eat food right i have to put oil i have to put oil in my hair and uh, in my beard so these all these all need expenses so i have some expenses to meet right so yes, that's why i asked for yes, some yes, money yes. help right if i okay, had okay. not if i did not have any stomach i would not have asked for any fee <laughs> <laughs> do you understand yes sir understand yes. okay then thank you we we, we can chat on uh, we can chat on whatsapp right no problem Okay, if, okay. if you have any problem you can ask me we are still friends we are still friends okay, we can definitely sir definitely and for 5 10 minutes you can talk to me for 5 minutes or for free <laughs> for free you can talk to me <laughs> that is a service i can provide for free right because you know okay, yeah. because you know teaching you know, if i don't spend time on you i will spend time on reading right so there i will invest my time i will if i if i am not earning then i am investing i will read some stories i will read some uh, you know grammar right in this one hour yes, yes. right so that is yes, investment yes, yes. that is investment i keep investing if i am not earning then i am investing my time okay time okay, is okay, money okay. time is money <laughs> but is money. Okay. my time, time is money money is important <laughs> yeah money is important because you know we all feel hungry you are also going to dubai for money only yes i am also <laughs> learning and money in dubai okay. are you are people learning money sir oh uh, anyway okay then thank you very much good night okay thank you sir good night, good night sir take care take care.